think it is. I think at some stage the season's going to be suspended without a doubt. I think you've got to look at the New Zealand Warriors. They're over here away from home. Once they decide to go home, they're out of the comp for two weeks. Now, you can't play the 16-team competition. You can't play a 16-team competition with 15 teams. That's just the way it is. So the, the competition's going to have to be suspended. The trouble with suspending if NRL players is that you can't just have an NRL player out of action for two or three weeks and then expect them to walk back in and start playing and doing what they're doing mm. this weekend. I mean, the, the pre-season goes for three or four months. Now, that's a long time to get prepared for a game of footy. So to go and have four weeks off, three or four weeks off, and expect them to come back and play at the level they're playing at, it's too dangerous for the players. You have shoulder, knee issues, um, player welfare just wouldn't be right. So I think they should suspend the season for an extended period of time so we have an end, end, a start date and an end date. Play every team once. Uh, once they've played every team, we have a top eight moving to a semi-final series. I, I think that's the best way to do it going so forward. 